Hello, Darren Alf here from BicycleTouringPro.com. Got a reader question asking, what type of bike tools do I carry on my bike tours all around the world? What's essential, what's not? I thought, what better way to answer that question than to show you the gear that I carry? So here it is. I've got a, a spare tube for my tires. I have a spare brake and derailleur cable. I have a patch kit, lightweight patch kit, which has glue, um, some patches, sandpaper, and a couple other miscellaneous things in there. I've got a pump which works with both Presta and Schrader uh, valves for your tubes. Um, I've got a half roll of handlebar tape which can be used for your handlebars but also for a number of other repairs that you might want to make while you're out on the road. I've got a lightweight pedal wrench here. This is the pedal wrench on this side which allows you to take your pedals on and off. Um, on this side of the wrench is an S&S coupler wrench. Um, some bicycles, the frame of the bike splits in half with the use of S&S couplers and this side of the wrench allows you to do that. Um, this particular wrench is a 10 millimeter wrench used for tightening um, the nuts on my bike's fenders. You might not have to carry this depending on the fenders that you have or the multi-tool that you're using. I have uh, two plastic tire levers which are used for getting your tires on and off of your rims. Um, I usually carry one, two, or three uh, spare rack screws. These are the screws that are used to hold your um, front and rear bike racks in place and also your water bottle cages. And sometimes while you're riding these screws wiggle themselves out and so it's always good, a good idea to have a couple extra. This is a spoke wrench which allows you to tighten, loosen, and adjust the spokes uh, on your, your bike's wheels. Um, if you're going to bring something like this, you need to know uh, not only what size spokes you have so that your, the wrench fits your bike, but also how to use this tool. It's kind of complicated, not totally straightforward, so you need to know how to use that if you're going to pack it. Um, this is my multi-tool which has various Allen wrench sizes as well as um, screwdrivers. Um, this is a small bottle of spare uh, chain lube to, to lube your chain. This is a small folding knife which I use mainly for food preparation but it could also be used in a number of different ways. And then finally uh, I am carrying a spare set of brake pads. Uh, these are for disc brakes. And so that's it. Those are all the tools that I carry. I, what you see here is relatively lightweight and can pack down to a very small size. Obviously I could carry a whole lot more than this if I wanted to. In certain instances um, I could carry a whole lot less. For example I might be able to get rid of this, 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 and even this and carry a much smaller kit, something like you see here. So that's it. Thank you so much for watching and if you have a question you'd like me to answer in a future Bicycle Touring Pro video, leave a comment down below. If you'd like to learn more about bicycle touring, whether close to home or anywhere in the world, check out my website at BicycleTouringPro.com or pick up a copy of the book, The Bicycle Touring Blueprint. I'm getting on the freeway here.